So this is the large torso model. This is the temporalis muscle, temporalis muscle. And this is the buccinator. The buccinator. On the other side here, you have the masseter. The masseter. The muscle around the eye is the orbicularis oculi. The orbicularis oculi. And around the mouth is the orbicularis oris. The orbicularis oris. This is the zygomaticus major muscle. Zygomaticus major muscle. And the zygomaticus minor muscle. The zygomaticus minor muscle. And this muscle here is the sternocleidomastoid muscle. The sternocleidomastoid muscle or simply the SCM. Yeah, so this is the masseter here. The buccinator is, is deeper. So underneath the masseter, you have the buccinator. All right, moving right along. This side of our muscle model are the more superficial muscles. These muscles are the deeper muscles. So this muscle here is the pectoralis major muscle. Pectoralis major muscle. If I were to take this off, underneath the pectoralis major, we have the pectoralis minor muscle. The pectoralis minor muscle. Here we have the internal intercostal muscles. The internal intercostal muscles. And That would make these the external intercostal muscles. The external intercostal muscles. Same thing I could ask about the external costal muscles uh, down here as well, okay, towards the back. And even here. Those would be the external intercostal muscles. So this is the spine of the scapula right here, making this muscle. The supraspinatus, the supraspinatus muscle underneath, so starting right here, all the way to here. That's the border here. Okay, this is the infraspinatus, the infraspinatus right there. This would be the terrace minor. Do it much on our own. This is the terrace minor. This is the terrace major, the terrace major. For the abdominal muscles, here is the rectus abdominis, the rectus abdominis muscles. Here I've got the, the external obliques, the external obliques. And this is deeper, so these are going to be the internal obliques. The internal obliques. In order to show you the transverse, I'd have to take that part off. And all of this is the transverse abdominus. The transverse abdominus. So this is the superficial side again. The superficial back muscles that you need to know is the trapezius, which includes all of these muscles here. This whole muscle here is the trapezius muscle. It's shaped like a diamond if you have it on both sides. This is the deltoid. That's the deltoid. Here is the latissimus dorsi the latissimus dorsi. So in this muscle model here, we have the temporalis muscle, the temporalis muscle. This muscle on the deep side, this is the buccinator, the buccinator. 
Moving this to the superficial side. Okay, I see the temporalis muscle. The temporalis muscle. The orbicularis oculi. Orbicularis oculi. This is the zygomaticus minor. Okay, right there. Zygomaticus minor. The zygomaticus major. Around the mouth is the orbicularis oris. Orbicularis oris. And this is a salivary gland. So underneath the salivary gland, that's where you get the masseter. The masseter. Okay. And here's part of the buccinator here too that you can see. Lies the buccinator lies underneath the masseter. On this side, I have the sternocleidomastoid muscle. The sternocleidomastoid muscle or SCM muscle. I have the pectoralis major muscle here. And if I were to take off the pectoralis major muscle, I would expose the pectoralis minor muscle. The pectoralis minor muscle. Between the ribs here, this would be the internal intercostals, internal intercostal muscles. And these would be the external intercostal muscles, the external intercostal muscles. I also have a point in the back where I can ask, and these are also external intercostal muscles. This whole muscle here is the trapezius, the trapezius muscle. This muscle is the latissimus dorsi, latissimus dorsi. This is the deltoid, the deltoid muscle. All right, so this is the deltoid. This is the spine of the scapula here. So this would be the supraspinatus underneath the spine of the scapula, just right here, is the infraspinatus, the infraspinatus. This small triangle here is the uh, teres minor, the teres minor, and then here is the teres major. Okay, the teres major is not considered one of the rotator cuff muscles, but it's right here in the same area. Here is the rectus abdominis, rectus abdominis, rectus meaning straight. Okay, this is deeper on this side of the body. So these would be the internal obliques, the internal obliques. And on the other side, the external obliques, the external obliques. Okay, so if I ask you, no, I could still ask you. If I can get it off, I can ask you it. So the transverse abdominus in these are right here. Okay, transverse abdominus. Okay, any questions about that one? In the arm model, this is the deltoid. This is the spine of the scapula. So this will be the supraspinatus. Supraspinatus. The infraspinatus. Infraspinatus. This tiny little portion here is the teres minor. The teres minor. And this would be the teres major. The teres major. Okay. Now, if we flip this over, here you see the subscapularis. The subscapularis. Okay, questions, comments, panic attacks. Sweet. Can we take the quiz now? <laughs>